This is going to be a little tutorial on how to set up DLNA on an Xbox One. Um, the best client that I've found so far for DLNA streaming is XBMC. Um, it's available for all platforms, um, Linux, Windows, Mac, even Android phones. Um, and it, it's quite remarkable. So basically you download the program, whichever operating system you have, and then you basically launch it. Um, and it just shows you kind of like a list of all, pretty much everything you have. So you can add music, just click on music. Um, you can, basically it gives you options to add music. Um, you can add videos, for example, Let's just say, like, I have the Desolation of Smog, that's the only file I have. You can just add videos and choose the folder, etc., etc., and just add that stuff. So I've added all my music, um, I've added a few pictures as well, right? and all my videos. Um, the last thing you have to do is you have to go to System, and then you have to go to Services. Alright? And you have to go to the UPnP tab and click on share video and music libraries to UPnP. So that basically allows you to make your computer into a server. So you can stream media to any device that's DLNA compatible on the same wireless network you are on. All right. So we've done that. All right. So you have to leave X BMC on when you're actually streaming content. All right, so I've done that. Left this on. Now let's go to the Xbox One. Xbox, go to Media Player. So as you can see, now my laptop, it's basically my name, um, it's already there. It's basically listed as a DLNA server through a wireless connection. That's what those like three bars indicate. Xbox Select. Asher Medan. Music Library. Albums. A Fine Mess. 99 times all right so now i just like downloaded random songs to just give you an idea so now it shows the artwork it's playing the song um i don't want to unmute my tv because there might be like copyright regulation or something but i'll unmute, unmute for like a second so you know that it actually works Xbox Play. Xbox Pause. So it definitely works and it worked rather well. Xbox Go Back. Oh crap, I don't think there's a back command here. Um, Xbox Go Home. Yeah. So basically you can do this for um, movies, you can do this for like TV shows, you can do this for music, but there's one catch actually. Um, you can't actually do it for DRM protected music movies um, and shows. So all the content that you stream from XBME, from your laptop, from your computer, has to be copyright. Basically, it shouldn't have any copyright protection. Um, there are programs out there that actually strip away copyright protection um, if you've already bought content, so it's it's not that hard. Um, or you could download music, movies, TV shows from sources that don't have any DRM, um, and you can pretty much play them like this. Just add them to your library on your computer, the XBMC library on your computer. Come over here, it'll show you the option, and you can pretty much play anything on your Xbox One. So it's just that simple. Download XBMC, set it up,
Remember to enable the UPnP setting in services and then download the media player on your Xbox One. When you just turn on the media player, it should automatically show you the DLNA server. Click on the DLNA server, it will show you an option to watch TV shows, movies, music, whatever you want to watch. Click on that, choose your favorite movie, TV show, song, and play it. It's that simple and it works flawlessly. That's it guys, I hope this tutorial was useless. I'm joking. I hope this tutorial was useful and um, I'll see you next time.